Hello, hello, what's up everybody? I'm the Gutsy Gamer and welcome back to Pokemon White Day 58 of the Pokemon Road to Pokemon Master Marathon. How's everybody doing? I am so freaking late and I am so, so sorry. It's just one of those days. <laughs> Not in a bad way, it's just that I've, uh... It's just one of those days where I get caught up and stuff. Again, not in a bad way, nothing bad happened or anything, but, uh, it just, I got delayed. But, let's try to make up that time by playing some Pokemon. Let me see. Okay. Cool. We got to a new town. We went through a big old electric cave last time that felt like it took forever, but it was, it was actually pretty fun. We got some evolutions that we got through. Or just one, I think. Excadrill. We got this beast of a Pokemon. This dude. I wish there was a way to, like, swap the screen to, like, make the Pokemon be at the top. Or not the top. At, well, well, top for me. Top screen. But, like, for you guys, like, the big main screen to the right. But, uh, he's a beast now. He's a big old beast. I want to explore this town a little bit. Apparently there's a gym here. Well, these people are in a square. Our family's very fussy about Pokemon moves. Okay. Just double checking here. I got the audio levels and whatnot. Everything looks good. Trading sweethearts uh, you receive through feeling checks is one way to get heart skills. If you show off your Pokemon to a lady in Driftvale City, you can get hard skills, too. Not interested in that for now. Oh, I had a repel on, apparently. Uh, who I was again? Oh, that's right. I'm the move deleter. You've come to make me force your Pokemon to forget some moves? Not yet. Maybe some other time. Everyone calls me the Reminder Girl. I know every move that Pokemon learn while they're leveling up. And I make Pokemon remember those moves. If you bring me a hard scale, I'll make a Pokemon remember a move. Cool. I don't have any hard scales. Nor do I have any moves that I want to relearn right now, so no worries there. Did I talk to you? Skyla's grandfather was a legendary pilot. Skyla is our city's gym leader. He's a really nice person. Sounds like it's going to be a flying type gym leader. So, lucky for us, Zebstrika needs some leveling. So that's probably going to be good for him. Oh. Who dat? Oh, hey, Gutsy, right? Let me see your Pokedex for a moment. What do we have here? So you found 63 Pokemon, eh? Staggering. You've seen a Clink. You're becoming quite the trainer. Excuse me, I was a little excited and I forgot my manners. My name is Juniper, too. Cedric Juniper. <laughs> the professor who gave you the Pokedex? It's my daughter. That girl has told me a lot about you. It really makes my day to meet you. In honor of our meeting, I'm going to upgrade your Pokedex. Ooh, National decks? Some Pokemon can change forms even when it's the same individual. If you've already seen a form, you can check this with you can check it with this whenever you want. I also added a function to make searching easier. Why thank you. Professor, who's that trainer? Oh, I forgot my introductions. Skyla, this is a friend of my daughter's. Gutsy is traveling around Unova to complete the Pokedex. Oh, I see, so that means you'll be challenging the gym. Oh boy, I'm really looking forward to it. That's right, Gutsy. You should challenge this gym. If nothing else, this gym is really out there. See you, Skyla. If something comes up again, I'll let you know. Professor, my plane is a cargo plane. It carries cargo, not people. And if you're talking as if places like Kanto and Sinnoh are right around the corner... Ah, oh, Skyla, if you keep frowning, your face might freeze like that, and it'd be a shame. People in Pokemon, we all have to help each other out. See you later. So this is like... American Professor Oak. <laughs> Sheesh. Hey, Ninja Blade. How's it going, dude? Haven't seen you in a while. How's it going? It's hard to believe a happy-go-lucky guy like that could be a world-renowned Pokemon professor. Yeah, so he is the Oak of Unova. He's like American Oak. Heads up, Gutsy. As a gym leader, I'd be happy to ha have you challenge the gym, but there's something I need to take care of first. Just now, I was flying the cargo plane. I saw something on top of Celestial Tower. I'm sure that is a sick Pokemon. Or I'm sure that it is a sick Pokemon. I thought she was like, that's a sick Pokemon. <laughs> that's because it's just vocabulary I use. 
I'm sure that it is a sick Pokemon. If it is, I can't just leave it there. I have to look into this right away. I'm leaving for Route 7 Celestial Tower. You can come along if you want. I totally get you, dude. No worries. I'm really happy you're here today. Hope you're doing well in school and stuff. I was just commenting. It's been a while since I saw you, and it's good to see you. Oh, yeah. Let me pop this up. I need to check if my streamland is working because somebody subbed last time I streamed and the notification didn't pop up. I just want to have that up so I can just like look at that at a glance. There we go. Pop this back up. Hey, Isaacer. You're watching on your phone since I disconnected my PC due to Streamlabs. I see. Well, I'm happy to have you. Also, Lythera had a subscription notif alert uh, issues too. Yeah, yesterday I had that issue. It was weird. It was a good thing I caught it at the moment, so I was able to still have the notification pop up, but like that would have been bad. Because it was a sub. I was like, oh my goodness. I almost missed a sub. Because Streamlabs didn't work. You have a gym badge from Mistralton. I'll tell you something cool. Okay. Cannons, cannons. Skyla's gym is full of cannons. Okay. You see field after field located near the runway. Freshly picked vegetables can be sent to faraway regions very quickly. Cool. You got anything, anything in trash? No. Okay. Okay, so we're supposed to go to Route 7. Because we're going to Route 7, I want to bring up my cheat sheet so I know which Pokemon to catch. Route 7. Pop that up right here. There's something called a Cub Chew that I can catch. But only in winter. It's not winter, so... I don't know how to change the seasons yet. Or if that's even a thing. You can catch Watch Hog, so that's good. And that's about it, it appears. Apparently it's unpheasant in shaking bubbling spots, but they're so rare, I'll probably do that some other time. So where is this place? The only planes that fly out of Mistralton Airport are cargo planes. If trainers want to fly, they can go with a Pokemon that knows flying. Cool. I don't have a flying type, unfortunately. It's dangerous to play in the landing strip, but you should be okay in ours. You only have one cargo flight a day. Planes, their shapes, they're perfectly designed to fly. There's no excess in the mechanics for flying. That's nice. Sky drop? Cool. I should really teach. Is that a flying type move? And if it is, can I teach it any of my Pokemon? Yes, it is. Nobody. Yeah, I was gonna use Woobat, but then. Unfortunately, I had the bad idea of looking up, like, stats for Pokemon. I looked up Woobat. Apparently, Woobat is a terrible Pokemon statistically. So I was like, oh, man, I don't want to waste my time on that. Which sounds kind of cruel, but, you know, it is what it is. It's a video game, after all. Pokemon and people work together to open up and desolate land and make a place where everyone could live. I'm certain that this cooperative spirit will remain unchanged. Either way, I gotta save, uh, I gotta save the spot for, like, that water Pokemon that those tanky they told me about. I kind of want to put that on my team, because I only have one more spot left in my team at the moment. This is where the gym is. I don't need to go to the gym yet. I need to go to Route 7, so. Is that Rue 7? Yes, it is. Hello? That raised walkway. If you stand still, you'll fall off, so you have to keep moving. So, like... I see. Okay. <laughs> I can always, uh, swap him out if I need to use fly. Oh, 
I love Pokemon moves Mega Drain and Giga Drain. Your opponent's HP is reduced and the user's HP increases. Do you know Giga Drain? Teach it to my... Servine? Can it be called a Bulldore? If you have, would you trade it for Bulldore for my Emolga? No. If you had a Bulldore, I would trade it, trade it for my Emolga, but no. I'm not gonna give you a Pokemon that I can't have. I got, I got excited for a sec there. I was like, oh, can I get this evolution? Alrighty. Thanks for the lurk. I appreciate it. Oh my god. Mirror match. Who will win? Uh, I definitely can't use any thunder moves. I'm just going to use flame charge on this guy. And this one's got the same idea. And it's apparently faster than mine. Hmm. It must have a... Um... A nature that increases speed. Mine's nature, I think, is just, like, adamant. Just more attack or something like that. Hopefully I can learn a fire move that's, uh, better soon. Thank you. Yeah, Flame Charge is not terrible. It's just a little bit on the weak side. But I think I can make do with it. So, who do I need to level up besides Zeb Striker? Solosis could use a level. But Zeb Striker needs a more. Maybe the rain is making the fire weaker. I don't know how rain works exactly. I know it makes it so thunder never misses. It makes water moves deal more damage. I don't know what it does to fire, though. It might make it weaker. Uh, I don't have stomp yet. If I learn it soon, I'll probably swap it with quick attack. I think I'm gonna go back a little bit. I think I missed a couple trainers. Like this one. Oh no, you're gonna make me do a triple battle? No! I don't wanna do triple battle. Oh, I hate that. Okay, I'm gonna do Spark on Woobat. I'm gonna do a Leech Seed on Lipard. Then I'm gonna do a Rock Slide on both these guys. That's a flinch. Drink this milk. 
Drink this milk. Okay, I'm gonna do a leaf blade on this guy. I will do a slash. Moo moo milk. Drink that milk. Ow. Ding. Oh, here we go. Speak of the devil. Stump. Yeah, let's let's uh forget quick attack. You're a fast enough Pokemon anyway, so. Don't need that no more. You can't do shit, so just hone claws. Just sit there honing your claws. <laughs> Dude, Excadrill looks so cool. You know, that, now that I think about it, isn't like the Drill Burr line kind of like the Sand Shrew of this gen? That's what it kind of feels like. Okay, let's go back. Oh, thank God, the AC just came on. I was just about to comment, it's freaking hot in here. Them's the, the deal when you're streaming. Gotta turn off AC and all that stuff. Well, I have... I, I unfortunately live in a climate where it's just, like, super, super hot every day, all day. So I'm always somewhere in between mid-80s to 90s, even in winter, most of the time. So... Uh, as a result, I'm always melting. So I got, I got a portable AC in my room that makes a lot of noise that I keep on all the time, except when I'm streaming. So that's super nice when I have to stream. So I, I kind of melt. So I'm just relieved that the AC kicked in right now. I thought it was a basketball. It looked like a basketball or something in, in the grass. Oh, it's this kid's hat. Palpitoad. Can't do crap to this guy. Um, if he uses a ground move, I'm toast, but uh, I can use Stomp. Oh, it's, it used Muddy Water. I should swap out. Yeah, I'm gonna swap out. Uh, Meryl can get a little bit of love here. I ain't taking that chance. I wonder when Servine will evolve. Probably pretty soon. Level Goliopede, that's a bug poison, I believe. Bug poison. So a ground type would probably be best. Because the psychic type would just be neutral because of the bug typing. So Excadrill, get in there. Yo. 
That Pokemon turned out looking cool. Too bad the one that I caught had a horrible nature. I don't know if, it, if it's all that good, but it lo definitely looks super cool. Ding. Shelmet. That's like a bug steel or something from what I've researched. Bug steel, so fire should do the most damage. So, Zebstra could get in there. Use that flame charge. That's a cute looking Pokemon. Stop spamming protect. Like it makes the kissy lips. Huh. That did way less damage than I thought it was gonna do. Oh no, yawn. The bane of my existence. No, I'm swapping out. I'm just gonna go to a fighting type. It may not even have the steel typing yet, to be honest. I guess I got my typings wrong. Fighting was neutral. Or not neutral, not very effective. Well, hopefully when I catch one, if I can catch one in white, I'll find out what typing it is. Struggle bug. I'm starting to think the water does... Or the rain does lower fire's effectiveness. Ultra Ball. We got another youngster right here. Hello. Webble bug rock. This Pokemon's got nothing against this guy. Bug rock. I could use fighting type. Rain does lower fire attacks. Okay, cool. Good to know. Thank you. Stop polishing your rock. That's lewd. <laughs> that was neutral. Are bug types resistant to, uh... Bug types are resistant to fighting. Huh. So I guess water is the best kind of move, but I don't have any water attacks, unfortunately. Hey! Simi Sage. That's the evolution. Uh. Sage. With the grass type. So, alright, that means. I need to use the fire type. What else can I use, though? That's all that's available to me in this party setup. Oh, that thing turns ugly. That is an ugly Pokemon. <laughs> oh, the thumbs up it has. I love it. Oh, but that thing's ugly, though. Oh! It's milk time.
Dang, Gutsy over here roasting the Pokemon. I'm sorry, that's an ugly Pokemon. Look at that thing. I do love the thumbs up it has though. Because I, I like I like doing thumbs ups. the VXP. Oh. That one single thumbs up, I know. <laughs> it's like, Simi Sage is like, I'm getting burned up, but it's all good. <laughs> oh, that's going to be super effective. I gotta remember it's a steel type now, so fire is super effective. Talk to this girl. Uh, but yeah. Hello? Oh, bold enough to come talk to me, are you? You're quite the trainer. I like you. Take this TM. Yeah, Excadrill is uh, steel ground, I believe. Charge beam. That seems good. Uh, so let me see. I'm not 100% sure, but I think that's what it is. Yeah, ground steel. Cool. Alright, uh, is Charge Beam any good, and can any of my Pokemon learn it? It uses Special Attack, and my Electric-type Pokemon uses Attack Stat, so this is not a good move for me to teach it. Nobody else can learn it besides Zeb Striker, so unfortunately, we're not using this TM. I want to go to the Celestial Tower, but I got lost and stranded. Okay. Yeah, it looks like the only Pokemon here that would be new is only in winter. Bummer. Okay. That Pokemon is ugly as hell, too. Oh my god. Are all three of the monkeys just ugly as crap? Flame Burst. Whoa. Lick. Oh, if I can't go anywhere, if I'm... St what? What did this guy say? The text goes so fast at the end of a trainer fight. If I don't just, like, read it internally, like, I'm not gonna be reading the whole thing. What was I gonna do? Oh, yeah, I was gonna swap out Pokemon, because uh, Zeb Striker's already 33, and poor Solosis here is stuck at uh, 31. Poor little guy needs to level up. Hopefully it'll evolve soon. It's about to level up, though. A strong little one. Yeah, you've got that killer special attack. Holy crap. 
Oh, you're level. You're evolving. Solosis is evolving. Yes. Cool. You're about to get stronger, little guy. You big gooey ball. Oh my god, it's growing a fetus. It's a fetus. Ew, duosion. It, I get I I get it. It's it's supposed to be a, a cell splitting. How cool. Duosion. It, it looks like a little fetus. Ew. <laughs> Ew. I still love it though. Delete is the fetus. <laughs> oh my god. I need to check its stats and its Pokedex entry, so I'm gonna do it after this. Oh, I shouldn't have used hidden power. Oh my god, stop using the tech, please. Stop it with the detect spam. So let's take a look at the stats. Oh man, a special attack went up by a lot over a hundred. Jeez. Apparently has high special attack in its nature, but its special defense goes down. Which is not that big a deal. I mean, most of my Pokemon are glass cannons anyway, so. No problem, Ninja Blaze. Alright, let's see, where is this? Where do you find Sigily? Archon. Two. Okay, Duosion. Duosion, the mitosis Pokemon. When their brains, now divided it in two, are thinking the same thoughts, these Pokemon exhibit their maximum power. That sounds cool. I love Psychic Pokemon. They have the power to melt your brain. Oh yeah, I forgot I have a, I have a Lucky Egg. Give that Lucky Egg to this little guy. Make him level up faster. Mincino. I think I'm gonna do a recover. Cool. I don't need that attack anyway. Not very effective. Man, I'm just one shotting stuff with Duosion now. I got more Viagra. Wadloon Bug Grass. That is not good for Duosion unless I can. What's well, bug types? It's gonna be not very effective. 
So I'm going to switch over to Zeb Striker for that quad damage with Flame Charge. Even though it's going to do less damage because of the rain. Man, the rain just makes fire attacks so weak. Insanely weak. Semi poor. Oh, that's the evolution of the water one. The one that I have. Okay, so I will just stay with this guy. Oh my god, that's the ugliest one of all. Holy crap, I have the ugliest one. Oh my god, that thing is... Ugh. Ugh. Get it out of my face. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that thing is... That thing is scary looking. The worst part is like waving at you. He's like, I just want to be your friend. And I'm like, no, ew, get away from me. I haven't seen any watch hogs in the wild yet. I think I caught one, though. I gotta check if I caught... I, I'm pretty sure I caught one already, though. Aksu. Ooh, that's a dragon bug one, isn't it? I don't have any ice attacks, though. Oh, man. I've got a hole in my, uh... in my team. I don't have anything to deal with dragon types. Uh, so I guess we'll go with... What's neutral for dragons? I guess psychic, but... We're, we're gonna take a future sight, but that's fine. I like dragon types. They kind of got neutered in Gen 6 onwards, though, because of the fairy type. Oh god. Damn. another fetus. My mom almost had a heart attack since there's a tornado an hour away. Oh, oof. I hope, uh, hope it doesn't get uh, close to you guys. Is this a tower?
They say that when you ring the bell on top of this tower, it pleases the resting spirits. Oh, this is like a graveyard. We're gonna see ghost Pokemon, huh? What's in the celestial tower? Let's pick my cheat sheet. Litwick. That's a ghost fire type. There's an Elegem too. And that's about it. Two Pokemon to catch here. One time, uh, I saw a tornado funnel, uh, that was developing. It looked like it was just like a couple blocks away or something. It was pretty close. Yeah, I don't think it ended up ever touching down or anything. But that was kind of scary. Happened a long time ago, though. When I was a wee lad. Oh, I remember this Pokemon. I caught it in uh, Omega Ruby. It's an alien-looking thing. Yeah, I played through Omega Ruby. Already. Scraggy, when's Scraggy gonna evolve? 35, 36, something like that, maybe? That's a psychic flying. So, we both can wreck each other. Uh oh, that's gonna hurt. Take that! Oh, you survived. Ugh. Let me swap over to Zeb Striker. Don't want any Caleb Pokemon. I don't have any revives right now. Can I outspeed? Yes. What's up, Jordan? That's a ding. Uh, I probably should have come with more potions and stuff. Is gonna be like a spot in this, like the red and blue versions, where it's like a little spot you step on and everybody gets healed. That'd be nice. No more milk. We're out of milk. Hey, that's a new Pokemon. Litwick. Oh, right. Ground is also super effective against fire. I need to use something else. Isn't it isn't having like a isn't that isn't this like really really uh offensive to like be battling Pokemon in like a graveyard? I I probably wouldn't fight here. I'd probably be like, can we take it outside? This is kind of disrespectful. Nope, state your dominance. That thing is the Chucky of the Pokemon world, really. I need an ether. Oh god. <laughs> Goth it duh. 
I still don't know what type of Pokemon this is. It was... I think it... It wasn't dark, though. Because when I tried to use a fighting move, it... I don't think it did anything. Uh, let's just put Meryl out there. I still haven't figured out what type this is. I thought it was dark type or something. Hey, give me back my Miracle Seed. Here, I'll give you this. You can take this seed. It's a ghost? Then why wasn't... Oh, no, actually, that makes sense. Ghost and fairy. Well, fairy doesn't exist yet, so just ghost for now. So I probably should have stayed with, uh... My psychic type. It just looks like a dark type for some reason. Apparently it's a black version exclusive, so I can't get it. Yeah, fairy type doesn't exist until the next gen. Gen 6. In the Kalos region. Sorry, go to my mom's getting scared, so I have to check my phone all the time. No problem, no problem. You do you. Comfort your mom. Tornadoes are scurry. Such an adorable Pokemon, and it's like surprisingly tanky. Well, I know what to do to you. I've got a move to deal with you now. Eat rocks. Eat rocks, you little flying squirrel. Ding. Pain split. That sounds interesting. Pain split. The user adds its HP to the target's HP, then equally shares the combined HP with the target. That's kind of weird. Adds its HP to the target HP, then equally shares the combined HP. I, I don't understand how that works. Um. I'm not gonna teach it that. I don't understand how that works, so I'm just not gonna learn it. Heard here. Don't be intimidated by that dog, just... Kick it in the face. A hundred HP of yours and a hundred twenty of the other HP. Yeah, but am I healing? Am I causing damage? I, I don't understand. It's sharing it. I think it makes me think like it's healing it. So like now like it, you're we're we're adding math into the mix and I'm just like getting confused because math and I don't really agree with each other.
Oh, I see. So it's like a gimmicky way to heal if you're like in a bind. Yeah, I have recover. That's better. <laughs> That's better most of the time. All right. What can I do that won't kill this thing? Um, how about a grass attack? I probably should have used just Mega Drain. But I think it should be okay. Yeah, we'll be okay. It's really good for low HP glass cannon types going against tanky types. Yeah, it's mostly situation though, though. I prefer just keeping recover for now. Oh, you bastard. Burning me. Take a thunder wave. That's a really weird sound effect for being burned. It's like, Burr! like what the hell is that, dude? It's like, is that Zeb Strike a barking in pain or something? It's a horse. Litwick, Ghost, Fire, Candle Pokemon. While shining a light and pretending to be a guide, it leeches off the life force of any who follow it. That's... That's horrifying. Let's keep that in the PC. Forever. Hence Chucky, yeah. I believe I have a burn heal. There we go. I was like right on it and everything. Perfect. I don't need another one of you right now. I will guess what you are. You are a Pokemon champ. Oh. Sure. You're not wrong. Whoa, it's, uh, pretty tanky. Oh, screw you. This is a risk right here. When are you gonna evolve, little guy? You're level 34. Hey, welcome, Pay. What's up, dude? Dude, this thing is tanky. You saw Captain Marvel yesterday? What do you think, dude? It was pretty good. Yeah, I liked it too. Me, uh, me and Jordan saw it uh, a couple days ago. Solid movie. Pretty excited for Avengers Endgame now. Also, did you see the trailer that uh, released this morning for it? Good trailer too. I'm hyped. No evolution for Scraggy yet. Uh, oop. Didn't expect uh, an encounter there. 
You did? Cool. Can't wait. It's only just a couple weeks. April. End of April. I thought it was May, but I when I saw the, the trailer, I was like, oh, shit. It's like sooner than I thought it would be. I should probably buy my tickets. That's not a good matchup. Me. Hopefully it doesn't use a ghost move. What is with that burn sound effect? It's like, bro! The only problem I had with Captain Marvel is they changed the original Captain Marvel, aka Marvel, into the female. Because Marvel is is a male in the comics. I get it. Oh fuck. That sucks. Um I don't mind it. I don't think it changes the the philosophy of the character too much. Like, it doesn't change, like, the, the point of the character or anything. Swoobat. Yeah, but it's also messing up some of the comics lore. Um, the movies and the comics are different. They don't need to follow the same thing. The Marvel Cinematic Universe is different. It's based on the comics, but they don't have to follow them. I thought somebody was burned. Alright, it was Duo Vision. Yeah, it's its own universe. I have iron. I don't know who would give that to you right now. Remember, all of these movies are based on their source material. They, they're not supposed to follow it. What the heck is that thing? That's a good point, Jordan. It's a ghost type. Okay. But it became money. What is money? Ah, go let go let. I think that's the evolution of Gothic, though. Don't have a psychic Pokemon alive right now, so we're gonna have to do with uh, the Zeb Striker or something. Oh, no, that's a completely different thing. That is a rock. <laughs> Rip. Let's see if X-Kadrill decides to 
Actually, Meryl's probably fine. Do a Mega Drain. I get what you mean, uh, Wakape, about, you know, not being part of the MCU. But just because it's an animated movie doesn't make it less of a... Like, I don't see why that would stop it from being part of the MCU just by being animated. But yeah, the the movies are not supposed to follow the comics. They just kind of it's kind of a uh what's the word I'm looking for? It's kind of like a general guideline, but they're not supposed to just follow it. If anything, that would be boring for it to just be following the comics if we already have the comics. Let them spin it into something different. Exactly, yeah, the MCU is its own lower universe. Perfect. You couldn't have said it better, dude. And they're, like, even if the MCU changes something that you don't like, it's not taken away from the comics. You can still enjoy the comics for what they are. The comics are still there. Doesn't take away at all from them. Good thing I didn't take that future site. That probably would have been bad. Ooh, are you a healer? So if this nurse beats me, does that mean, like, she'll just let my Pokemon be fainted? <laughs> That's kind of messed up. <laughs> the characters in the MCU are the exact same characters that you are completely correct. You are correct, but, uh, I, uh, don't see where you're coming from here. Or not where you're coming from, I don't. I don't see what you're trying to prove there, man. Like uh, Jordan said, the MCU has its own lore and universe. Apart from the comics. They are the same characters. You're right. But uh, it's a different universe and lore. A lore that's being has been built on for over a decade now. Do too bad. A loma, a loma mola. The fish consume its soul. It doesn't matter, Gutsy. I mean, it kind of does, dude. I guess we can just disagree, uh, agree to disagree.
Yes, free heals. Okay, let's do some shuffling. Uh, Excadrill is the lowest level right now. Hey, cool. Let's catch this little guy. I believe this is just a psychic type. It's not unheard of for uh, creators to, you know, change stuff around when putting it on, you know, the big screen. Again, it's its own lower universe, so little changes like this happen. Gotharita. That must be the evolution. Hey, don't be taking my lucky egg. That's my lucky egg. Oh, God. Don't hit yourself. Don't hit yourself. There you go. Destroy it. So, huh? I thought it was ghost type. Oh, it's psychic. I keep forget. No, you guys told me it was ghost type. Is it psychic type? Huh. Let's, let's swap. Is it a psychic type? Hold on. This is risky, but I wanna I wanna see something. Maybe it changed typings when it evolved. No, that's dark. Huh. I'm confused. Oh, well, I still won that. Shadow Claw? Hell yeah! Well, who can teach Shadow Claw? I have a ghost type move. Only Excadrill. Do we delete? I think it's time for Hone Claws to go. Yo, look at this big fluffy dog. Look at this guy. Oh my god. I didn't know he got another evolution. 
Holy crap, dude! Dude, look at this majestic pup! Kick it in the face! Oh! Kick it in the face! No! No! The one time it missed! No! Damn! Ouch. Consume its soul. I will not go down. Consume. Ding. Must be level 36 when this guy evolved. Or this girl, I mean. Scraggy up again. Uh, I don't want to use these hyper potions. I got a lot of them though, so. In my opinion, they disrespected the original Captain Marvel by not only leaving him out, but making his namesake a female. What's wrong with being a female, dude? There's nothing wrong with that. I'm going back. Huh. Man, I probably shouldn't have used that revive then. I should have gone back to the nurse. Jordan, don't don't be like that. You still have right. <laughs> Walker Bay's entitled to his opinion. Hey, it's the gym leader. What up? Where's the sick Pokemon? Oh, you came. Thank you. I was right. What I saw was a hurt Pokemon. Don't worry though, it's fine now. I gave it a max revive, then it felt better and flew away. Aw, I wanted to catch it. <laughs> Don't I have great eyesight? No matter how far away things are, my pilot's eyes can see them. Oh, that's right. Since you've come this far, why don't you ring the bell? Celestial Tower's bell is for soothing the spirits of Pokemon. Also, the character of the person ringing the bell is reflected in its sound. Okay. The sound of the bell reverberates through the area. What a pretty sound. Gutsy, you're a kind and strong person. It's that kind of sound. I'd like to introduce myself again. I'm Skyla, the leader of uh, Mistleton's Pokemon Gym. I use flying-type Pokemon. When you're ready, please come to the gym. I'll give you a big welcome. Okay, goodbye. Jordan, come on, dude. Don't be that guy. Jordan, don't be that guy. Oh, come on. You have, you're making me run all the way down? 
Wagabe, don't take Jordan seriously. He's trolling you. Jordan likes to troll. That's just the kind of guy he is. He trolls once in a while. He doesn't mean anything bad by it. He just likes to tease people. But yeah, welcome, Bill. What we're trying to tell you is that uh, sometimes in media, when people have the rights to something, they they will sometimes take creative liberties. Um, if you feel that, you know, that they messed up the character, well, I mean, it is what it is. You're entitled to your opinion. It's not incorrect. But sometimes people just want to change the story a little bit. Just gotta accept it and move on. You still got the comic books to, uh, to love. I'm glad you liked the, uh, um, uh, Captain Marvel. I thought it was a pretty good movie. I enjoyed myself. I went in that movie with low expectations and came out pretty, pretty happy. It was a good movie. What do they do in Harry Potter, Jordan? Uh, from what I can remember, the movies don't really deviate much. If anything, they kind of cut stuff out for time. But they stay pretty close to the source material. Was that guy there before? Yes. Yes, he does. He just kind of sticks out. Oh man, I'm getting so hungry. Gym time. Thanks for the what? Just between you and me, rock, electric, ice, flying types have more weaknesses than people know about. Use Pokemon and moves of those types, victory victory is practically yours. By the way, to proceed in this gym, you climb the cannons to move forward. Just looks so weird. <laughs> Alright, so what am I what am I doing here? What's going on here? Uh Nani? Did, did, did I just go back in? Oh, okay. It's going to be easy levels for Zeb Striker. I 
anything. In order to jump higher, I am practicing really hard. Jumping can be bad for your knees. Ducklet. Speed most of the Pokemon here, so that's good. Man, it's been a long time since I've seen Iron Man 1. I need to see it again. I remember really enjoying that movie. Jordan, you remember when we saw that in theaters? That was great. That was over 10 years ago at this point. How crazy is it that 10 years ago I was still an adult? That's how old I am at this point. Discharge. It's special though. Ew. Ew, no. No, thank you. I saw Iron Man 2. I didn't enjoy it more than the first one though. But it was good. I liked it. I never saw 3 though. I heard 3 was bad. So I'm back here again. Ah. Ooh, that's a new Pokemon. Why would you taunt me when you're like so low on health? I actually liked Iron Man 2 more than Iron 1, but I really liked all the Iron Man movies. Fair enough. Never seen it, so I can't say. Whoa, through the loop. Loopy loop. 
Oh, I see another loop. Woo! Two loops. Double loops. Oh my god! Uh... Is that safe? Did my character just suffer an injury? Lawsuit? I'm <laughs> just kidding. Gym, gym leader time. Uh, I should have enough PP. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Did you enjoy flying with the help of the Mistrelton gym cannons? They're my pride and joy. This time, let's try something else. Whoa, she's wearing booty shorts. <laughs> For the first time, I actually play a Pokemon that are higher level. Most people say Iron Man 2 wasn't as fresh as 1, and I don't know why. They introduced War Machine in Black Widow, and Nick Fury in Iron Man 2. Uh, wasn't Nick Fury in a lot of the previous movies and a lot of the Stingers? I remember seeing Fury at the end of Iron Man 1. Hell, I saw him at the end of The Hulk. Whoa, that one looks different. Male, female difference? That's cool. Whoa, you survived. They were in the stingers, like, uh, Nick Fury comes at the end to recruit them. At least I think so. It, it has been over 10 years, but I remember seeing, uh, Samuel Jackson a lot. Suwana. Whoa, haven't seen that Pokemon. Is that what Duck Lit evolves into or something? This was the easiest gem in the game so far. <laughs> Either way, I, I'm almost certain at the end of the Hulk, Nick Fury was there, at least in that. That was, I think, right after Iron Man 1. That one I can almost guarantee. Almost. Again, it's been over 10 years since I've seen both of these movies. Acrobatics. Alright, let's see. Can anybody learn acrobatics? I hope so. I, I really would like to know, Akape. If you could look it up, that'd be awesome. I'd, I'd love to know if I'm wrong or not. Or if you're right or, like, whatnot. I, I just... I, I want to know if my memory is failing me or not, is what I'm asking. Uh, nope, no acrobatics for anybody. What do I got here? Oh, her, her cannon right here. Oh, I broke my knees. Oh my god, it's N. They may say it is for understanding one another better, but what trainers really use battles for is to compete. And he hurt each other's Pokemon. You're not wrong, dude. Am I the only one who finds this terribly painful? In the Pokemon universe? Yes. <laughs> Whatever. I'm going to talk to your Pokemon. I've been living with Pokemon since I was born, so it's easier for me to talk with them than with people. Because Pokemon never tell lies. Are you sure about that? Hey, Zebstrika. Can you tell me what kind of trainer Gutsy is? Okay. Okay, got it. So Gutsy was born in Nuvema Town, 
lives with mom, and was given the Pokedex to start off a journey to see the world. Still, the Zeb Strikers trust you for some reason. That's good. If every person in Pokemon cared about one another like you two do, I could watch over the future of people in Pokemon without having to liberate Pokemon from people who just use them. Getsis is using Team Plasma to search for some special stones. The Light Stone and the Dark Stone. These stones hold the essence of two legendary Pokemon. It is said that when they lost their physical form, they fell into a slumber and were transformed. Now, they wait for the hero's arrival. I should resurrect the legendary dragon-type Pokemon from one of these stones and become its friend. That will show the world that I am the new hero. Everyone will follow what I say. My vision is to change the world without using force. Trying to change the world by force will just make others resist. If people resist, the ones that will be hurt are the innocent Pokemon. Used by foolish trainers. You understand. Pokemon are not just tools for people to use. As a result, Pokemon and trainers who care about one another, like you and your Pokemon, will be separated. And that does break my heart a little. Okay. I stayed for the mid credit scene in Captain Marvel. That was that was pretty cool. How uh well, I'm not going to spoil it. I don't want to spoil it for people who haven't watched it. But yeah, I, I saw the mid credit scene and I enjoyed it too. Oh, I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. Oh, I should sock up on uh, revives and healing items and whatnot. Ooh, I can get Ultra Balls now. She was fun to watch, though sometimes she would be a little bit stiff interacting, but I think that was intentional. She definitely had a, a lot of chemistry between uh, she and uh, Samuel Jackson. I think Samuel Jackson stole the show in that. Samuel Jackson was so good in that. Okay, where are we going now? Seven again. So where do we go now? Let me take a look at the map. Where am I going? Oh, yeah, here we go. Town map. Yeah, I keep going to, through past the Celestial Tower. I guess there's a part beyond this Celestial Tower? Uh, I guess we'll see. I don't know what you're talking about, but I thought Brie Larson did an amazing job. She still, Yeah, she didn't do bad. I didn't, I'm not saying she did bad or anything. I'm just saying there were parts where it kind of seemed forced. But like I said, she still did good. Okay, so it looks like there's a... This is a dead end. Unless there's like a path here to the side. But yeah, she and Samuel Jackson had great chemistry.
like this little finger. You know, that's what I like about you, Wakupe. You, you sometimes will disagree with me, and that's a good thing. We have different opinions, and I really, uh, I really appreciate that about you. That you uh, can disagree with me. Where am I supposed to go now? Oh, this is your path right here. I have no idea where I'm going. We came from this cave. And up here is kind of like a dead end. Oh, my stomach is growling so much. I need to eat. <laughs> It, like, it looks like I can continue here from where the map looks. I'm, like, zoom in. Go ahead, what's... Oh, wow, that, that, that helps. I'm trying to see if I missed something. Oh, here we go. Yeah, here we go. It branches off here. Hello? Skype call? Oh, ma'am! Gutsy's your mom. How are you doing? Wow, you're already on Route 7? You've gone quite far. Say, how are your Pokemon? Can't get that far all by yourself, you know. It's all thanks to your Pokemon. Don't forget to take care of them. Am I being too serious? Well, take care. Senior trainer mom signing off. That's right, she used to be a trainer, too. Mom, who's my dad? I wonder how far this route goes. Because I'm getting kind of hungry. <laughs> Hold on, I'm going to take a, a, a quick break. I want to see if, like, if the food's cooking. Because, like, there's no point in me uh, stopping now just because I'm hungry. If there's, like, no food yet. I want to see if food's cooking, so. Uh, I'll take, I'll just be right back. I'm just going to check. So, see it just a little bit.
All right, I'm back. Apparently there's nobody home. I am completely alone right now. So I don't know what's gonna happen with the food situation. Um, I guess I can continue for a little bit though. Or maybe I should cook something. I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe I should have made a phone call. Are these guys gonna- are we gonna battle on- oh. I didn't mean to fall off. Fungus. Melt its brain. Melt its brain. Melt this bird's brain. So this is a clown adult or a clown kid. Looks kind of like a clown kid, huh? Ow. No! Damn it. Damn it. Double damn it, I mean. <laughs> Ding. Ducklet. I kind of want to get uh, Meryl to evolve. Pretty sure it might be level 36. At least it should be. This should do neutral damage. Didn't mean to fall off. Hey, did we catch one of these? We did catch one of these. Okay. There we go. So if this Pokemon just copied my stat changes, does that mean that its speed went down because I'm paralyzed? Hog, look at Pokemon. They make the patterns on their bodies shine in order to threaten predators. Keen eyesight lets them see in the dark. They have freaky looking eyes, dude.
I need to use the paralyzed heal. I wonder if they sell full heals yet. I probably should have bought some. You son of a bitch. Ow. Oh! Oh my god. Scraggy, destroy this guy. Kick it in the face. No! Damn you! Why is that a priority move? Screw you! Scraggy, fight through that shit. Ah! You need to die! You and your tricks! Super Fang is just too OP, man. It it eats half your damage right... I mean, half your health right there. Oh my god. Hey, ding. I'm gonna go back to town. Oh yeah, let me buy some, uh, full heals. It's about like a ton of these. Also, do we have any new TMs here? Hail, sunny day. Rain Dance, Sand... Those are horribly expensive. What the crap? Screw you. Like, I know they're reusable TMs, but frick, dude. Twist Mountain. Okay, so this is where I'm supposed to go. Can we go back for a little bit? Because I saw there was like another path I can take here. Oh! That's tricky. Hello.
That's not gonna do a lot of damage because of the rain. Hopefully no burn. Destroy. Melt its brain. All oh, right, doesn't affect it. Damn it. Thing. Oh, damn it. <laughs> that angle is just hard for me. So when high jump kick misses, it hurts. I guess that's the uh, the risk of it. That's why it's so high damage because of the risk associated with it. Oh, oh, just a double battle. Oh god. I'm gonna give you a potion. Or water. Water's fine. Again? That must be double battle grass. Yeah, I'm running away from this battle. Oh, come on. Ouch. Oh, God. Consumed your soul. I find it weird that Pokemon would just work together in the wild like this.
Good job. Let's heal up. So falling in that grass sucks. Didn't buy super potions too? I did. Should have used that. I was being a dumb dumb. Damn it, I keep doing the same thing. I just walk slowly, right? I don't like you. I'm just going to take care of this guy right away. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. I erased own claws and I get this freaking Pokemon with double team. Yes! Die! I hate him, Olga. Oh wow, does he just like stay there now and I can't get that Pokeball? Hold on. I could just do this. x or or Scissor, x Scissor. That's a bug move. Bug moves are important. Who can learn x -Sizor? That's a good move too. Please let someone be able to learn it. Damn! Oh, Excadrill can learn it. Damn, do I get rid of Slash? I think I might. This crits, though. This seems like an upgrade over. It gives it more coverage, I guess. Actually, I'm going to get rid of Shadow Claw. Because I get the feeling we're going to learn like a steel move pretty soon on Excadrill. And that's I want to have that on uh, Replace Slash instead. All right, let's go over here now. Damn it. Let me run away. Don't be a bitch, alright? Let me run away. I know you got the advantage and all, but I've got like nine levels on you. There we go. 
this encounter rate. Redick. This guy will try to fight. Hopefully he doesn't use like a super fang or something on me. Alright, what kind of Pokemon can we find in Twist Mountain? Whoa. Streamlabs crash. I don't know if anybody subscribed or followed or anything during this. Let me check. Nope, looks like we're good. Hopefully. Let's see, Twist Mountain. You can find Girder. That's a new Pokemon. Cub chew only in winter. That sucks. We can find Cryogonal. Okay, that's a new Pokemon. Okay. Oh! What's up, Sharon? Since we both hold the jet badge now, let's see which one is stronger. Let's go. Bad matchup for me. You asked for it. Ding! Pig Knight. Excadrill. I should have really used the fire move. <laughs> Ding. Earthquake. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, bye, bulldoze. Sage. That's the grass thing. Alright, we'll uh, throw Zeb Striker in there. It is raining now. Nice crit.
Don't miss. Damn it. Don't miss. Nice. That was a fine Pokemon battle. I'm happy to see you're both growing as trainers. Oh, it's the champion. If it isn't the champion Alder, I'm weak, so I lost. And honestly, it bothers me when you call it a fine battle despite that. Oh, honestly, Sharon. Just accept the compliment without the stinging remark. I've asked you this before, but what do you plan to do after becoming strong? If I get strong and become a champion, that'll be the reason for my existence. I want to prove that I'm really living. Hmm. You remind me of Marshall. Of course, having something you want to want to become is important. But what is even more important is what you do with your newfound power. Anyway, take this. Here, you too. Surf! Yeah! I don't have a water Pokemon yet. If you use the move Surf, you can travel over water. I shall see you again, young trainers. Don't forget about the needs of the Pokemon at your side. Goodbye. What do I do with my power? I don't know that answer yet. First, I want to become a strong trainer, so everyone will acknowledge that power. Gutsy, next time, I'll win. Okay. Boldor. All right, I'm going to call it here for today. Let me save it up. I just looked at the time and I realized I am starving. It's getting late for me. So I'm going to end it here, as I normally do. Thank you guys so much for watching. Tomorrow is Final Fantasy Friday, so look forward for that if you like watching the Final Fantasy XIV streams. If not, I will be back Saturday at noon, Eastern Time. Or Eastern Daylight Time? I don't know. I read that somewhere that EST is not correct anymore because of the daylight savings, which just makes me hate it even more. But uh, I digress. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Later.